how to configure Windows to create a dump file for when you get a BESOD. Configure dump file settings at startup and recovery. 1. Open the start menu. Copy and paste system property ace advanced. X into the search box and press enter. 2. If prompted by USC, then click on yes. Windows 7 or continue. Vista 3. In the advanced tab, click on the settings button under startup and recovery. 4. Check both the write and event to the system log and automatically restart boxes. 5. Do not have Windows create a dump file on BSOD. A. Select None from the right debugging information drop down menu and click on OK. B. Go to step 9. 6. To have Windows create a small memory dump. Mini dump file on BSOD. A. Select small memory dump, hash KB, from the right debugging information drop down menu. B. Check to make sure that small dump directory has the location below entered for it, and click on OK. Percent system root percent mini dump. C. Go to step 9. 7. To have Windows create a kernel memory dump file on BSOD. Note, this is the default setting. A. Select kernel memory dump from the right debugging information drop down menu. B. Check to make sure that dump file has the location below entered for it. Percent system root percent memory. DMP. C. Check the overwrite any existing file box, and click on OK. D. Go to step 9. 8. To have Windows create a complete memory dump file on BSOD. Warning. See the note box at the top of the tutorial for important information about the page file. Requirements for this type of dump file to be created. This option will not be available if you have 2 GB or more of RAM installed. A. Select Complete Memory Dump from the right debugging information drop-down menu. B. Check to make sure that dump file has the location below entered for it. Percent System Root Percent Memory DMP C. Check the overwrite any existing file box, and click on OK. D. If prompted, click on OK. E. Continue on to step 9. 9. Click on OK. 10. If prompted, click on Restart after you save and close anything that you have open.